Hey guys, this is Astronomical Thoughts and in this video, we're going to be discussing why black holes look like this. So this is also how the black hole looked like in the movie Interstellar. And so before I can explain that, I need to tell you guys how very heavy objects impact the way light travels. So let's say we're on Earth and there's a star on the other side of the sun. Now common sense would lead us to believe that because the sun is in the way, we would not be able to see the star as the light from the star will get blocked by the sun and so the light from the star will not reach earth however because the sun is so heavy it is actually going to cause light to bend so why will light bend well because the sun will curve the fabric of space around itself because it's so heavy and any object including light that travels inside this curve that object's path will also be curved so in this example light is traveling near the sun and so its path will be curved too as a result we'll see the star even though it's behind the sun however our brain thinks that light can only travel in a straight lines so if we're seeing the light from the star then our brain thinks that the light cannot be coming from behind the star and from a common sense perspective that makes sense and so our brain automatically thinks that the source of light is exactly behind the light and therefore we would actually see the star here even though in reality it's not there okay so now we're ready to discuss why a black hole looks like this and just to clarify, the dark part in the middle is the black hole. And it's important to note that a black hole is like a sphere and that a sphere's color is black. So why is the black hole a sphere? Well, because initially a black hole is just the interior core of a dead star, which happens to be a sphere. And it's black because it happens to be really heavy, which creates gravity so strong that even light, which is the fastest thing in the universe, cannot escape it. So normally the structure of a black hole should look like this where we have the black hole in the middle and matter orbiting around it in a disk shape very similar to how planets orbit the sun in our solar system. So from this picture you may have noticed that we cannot see the back of the disk because the black hole is in the way. But we know black hole is really heavy much heavier than our sun and so if our sun has the ability to curve light then a black hole can definitely curve light. So if we were to take Take a look at this black hole from a different perspective we can get a view of how this black hole may curve light so imagine we're standing on the left looking at the black hole and we're not able to see this part but light coming from this part of the disk will curve towards us because of the black hole and reach our eyes making our brain think that the top of the back disk is here and light from the bottom section will also curve towards us making our brain think that the bottom of the back disc is here so coming back to the original picture we'll see that the top of the back section of the disc will appear here and the bottom of the back section of the disc will appear here and now if we compare this to the black hole picture we saw at the beginning it is clear that this is the black hole, this is the disk, this is the top of the back disk, and this is the bottom of the back disk. Now hopefully this was clear. Um, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section below. Uh, thanks for watching and I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Take care. I'm going to step off the limb now. That's one small step for man. One giant leap for mankind.